السلام علیکم ان دس ویڈیو وی ول ڈسکس آئی ایکسل اسکل جی سی فائیو اینڈ دی نیم آف دی اسکل از ملٹی پلائی اے پاور آف ٹین وتھ ڈیسیملس فائنڈ دی مسنگ نمبرس اوکے وٹ وی آر ڈوئنگ وی آر ایکچولی ملٹی پلائنگ وتھ دی پاور آف ٹین یو کین آلسو سی دیٹ وی آر ملٹی پلائنگ وتھ دی ملٹیپل آف ٹینس اوکے ملٹیپلس آف ٹین اوکے اینڈ وی آر دا نمبر از مسنگ ان دس اکویشن so we need to put the right number in the uh, in the box so that the equation can be satisfied so as we always have practice to understand the skill with the help of uh, the given example so first let's open this and this is the question we need to write we need to put the right number in this box so that this equation uh, is true and what number is to be multiplied with 0.1 so we have 3.55 so this is the question and what is the key idea i again say in this video that key idea is very important for every skill if you understand the key idea so you will solve that skill according to that key idea because you have to practice that idea in that skill okay uh, only completing the skill is not uh, uh, should not be an objective uh, but to practice the key idea so that you can use it uh, in upcoming assignments as well so you know what is the key idea what is the key idea uh, when you multiply by 1000 the decimal moves to three places to right so uh, when you uh, when you multiply with the any multiple of 10 the number does not change you will have the same digits as you have but only the decimal point moves either right or or to the left it depends what number which multiple you are multiplying okay but uh, but the one thing is very common that only decimal points moves the digits does not change okay so how decimal point move it depends on the multiple which you are multiplying uh, for example when you multiply this multiple of 10 which is 1000 so the decimal point moves three places to right you should write this somewhere so that uh, you can easily use it when you are practicing it so i i recommend you to write uh, this in a short way to in your copy somewhere so do so that you can easily practice this while you are completing this skill uh, and when you are multiplying with 100 so decimal point will move uh, uh, two places to right as you can see there are three zeros in this multiple so we are moving three places to right here we have two zeros so we are uh, uh, moving two places to right and if we have one zero so we are mo we move a uh, one place to right so this could be an uh, uh, a trick to uh, memorize this and similarly if we have four zero so we will move four places to right okay this is same but when we have decimal like this we have a decimal uh, we have one uh, uh, after decimal uh so we have one decimal place in these multiples we do not have any decimal place but in this we have one decimal place okay 0.1 so in this case when we have decimal so uh, we uh, move the uh, decimal point to the left when we have decimal so we move to the left and uh, as we were uh, as we were moving according to the number of zeros when we do not have decimals to the right and when we have decimal so we move according to the decimal places we have like we in in this uh, in this multiple 0.1 we only have one decimal which is one so we are moving one decimal to left and in this multiple we have two decimal places zero and one we have two digits after decimal point so we have two decimal places in this multiple so uh, when we multiply this so uh, our decimal with uh, move two decimal places because here we have two decimal places to left so similar in short you can memorize it if we have zeros like this so we will uh, move to right and if we have decimal point so we will move to left and uh, according to the number of zeros uh, we move uh, the number of places and uh, according to the decimal places we have in our multiple we move the decimal places to left so these are the two concepts you have to memorize so if you have written somewhere so you can easily use it so let's first discuss the question given in the example uh the missing number was multiple of 0.1 to make okay so this is the question uh, we need to multiply uh, we need to multiply something which we do not know with 0.1 which is the multiple of 10 to get 3.55 again uh, we have discussed that when we multiply with the uh, with any multiple of 10 only decimal places move with digit digits does not change so in this uh, in, in here we should have 355 the digits should be same the digits should not be changed but decimal point changes 
ओके सो वैन वी वैन वी मल्टीप्लाई इफ वी वी आर राइटिंग इधर थ्री फाइव फाइव सो वैन वी मल्टीप्लाई इट विद वन डेसिमल प्लेस सो वन डेसिमल प्लेस मूव टू हेयर सो दिस मीन द डेसिमल पॉइंट मूव टू लेफ्ट बिकॉज वी हैव जीरो पॉइंट वन सो डेसिमल प्लेस मूव टू लेफ्ट सो वी हैव टू इमेजिन दैट वॉट नंबर वैन वी मूव वन डेसिमल प्लेस टू लेफ्ट एंड सो वी गेट थ्री पॉइंट फाइव फाइव सो द नंबर शुड बी थर्टी फाइव पॉइंट द डेसिमल शुड बी हेयर द डेसिमल शुड बी हेयर बिकॉज वैन वी मल्टीप्लाई विद जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सो इट हैव मूव टू वन प्लेस टू राइट सो इट हैज नाउ हेयर सो द नंबर विच शुड बी हेयर शुड बी थर्टी फाइव पॉइंट फाइव एज यू कैन सी लाइक दिस right so we are we are working backwards to find the missing value do the opposite since uh, uh, we are not finding the product this rule apply to find the product but here we are not finding the product but we need to uh, find uh, uh, the uh, the factors or the missing number from the equation so we have to work backwards so we uh, we, we will have to back um, work backwards so as to find this product we have to move one place to left but since we are writing the missing number from here so we have to do the opposite when you need to find the factor so you have to do the opposite of these and when you need to find the product so you will apply these rules this is very uh, with obvious or this is very common sense okay so uh, it uh, we are we want to get this so we are doing opposite uh, one place to left so we will move one place to right so from here decimal will uh, come to one place to right and it will become 35.5 which is the missing number from here okay isn't it simple yes it is very simple but you have to practice and focus with your mistakes if you are doing so uh, write down some your mistakes somewhere and you will be learning from your mistake with the bit of time the passage of time you will have grip on this skill very conveniently okay so now let's practice this together find the missing number we have to practice it okay this is 32 times something equals 520 so again you can see we have to multiply any multiple uh, let me take any multiple if i will if i multiply with 100 so what will happen it has two zeros so the decimal point will move to two places to right and it will become 5200 this is not 5200 it means we only want one extra decimal place in this number it is 52 and we want 5 to 0 which is 520 so we want, we we need to multiply any multiple of 10 with only one zero along so it if he has 10 so only one place will be uh, added to this number and it will become 520 so the missing number was 10 well done next again the number is missing so we we, we know that the digits does not change when we are multiplying with the and with any multiple of 10 so digits will remain same only the decimal place moves according to the condition so as again we need to find the factor from the equation uh, not the product so we have to work backwards okay uh, when we multiply 0.1 so what we do we move a decimal to left one place because it has one decimal place so uh, uh, it uh, the decimal moves to one decimal place so uh, as we need to find the factor so we have to ba work backwards so uh, instead of left we have to move the decimal to right so we will have decimal right here so it will become decimal has moved from here it is the, it is the number the decimal has moved from here to here so now it has become 35.5 now you can check it out whether your answer is right or wrong when you multiply 35.5 with 0.1 so according to the rules we have written down in our copies it is uh, the uh, decimal will move to left and one place so when from here decimal will move to left to one place so it will become 3.55 so it means this number is right which we have written okay so let's submit this brilliant Okay again we have to write any multiple of 10 here so that we will have 0.63 to 6.3 so what is happening you can see the decimal is moving to right right and uh, one place to right so when we are having a decimal place to right we do not we should not be having a uh, a uh, um, uh, a decimal in our multiple of 10 so we have to multiply any multiple uh, for example a uh, uh, one uh, here and we need to move it on to only one right here only one place so we need to put only one zero here so it will become this 
the short trick you can write uh, if you are increasing the number uh, then you have to multiply uh, with without decimal number and when you are decreasing the number you have to multiply with the decimal number uh, it is it could be the another strategy to solve this skill for example uh, this is 2.4 this is 2.4 and it is 24 so 24 is definitely bigger than 2.4 so we have to uh, multiply any multiple with zeros okay and con number of zeros will be depend uh, how many places of zeros you want to move uh, 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 here we have decimal point before zero and uh, to make this we have to move it to one place to write so we will multiply with the multiple with one zero like ten okay superb again this question uh, let me see uh, this is the question so again we know that whenever we multiply with the multiple of 10 digits does not change uh, so uh, uh, so we have 5 and 6 so but the decimal place should be somewhere else uh, for example uh, if I multiply this 556 five, with this number so what this number do this number moves the decimal to uh, left and two digits because it has two decimal places 0 and 1 so there are two decimal places so the place uh, should move to uh, 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 to a left to two decimal places so it should be like this because if we have like this so uh, we have to des move to decimal to uh, two left places so this is the one place and this is the second place here we have decimal so we will get 56 okay so this should be the right answer last question we are discussing uh, for this skill again we need to multiply any multiple of 10 uh, what what we were going to get to it uh, again we are increasing the number or decreasing the number we are decreasing the number because this is 527 and this is 52.7 so 52 is definitely less than 527 so we are decreasing the number so we have to take something which are which is a decimal value okay so uh, how much place we need to move only uh, here we have decimal after 7 and here we have decimal before 7 so we just need to move decimal to one place so we need to get the one place in our multiple of 10 so it is 0 0.1 that's great so I what I would recommend you uh, uh, I am just giving the wrong answer so that I can show you what uh, just write it write these uh, rules somewhere shortly and then whenever you are writing any equation like this so just uh, just cross check whether your your product is of same uh, answer as the product or not fill the number then check out both the sides are equal or not after multiplying your given number whether you are having the same number as after applying this rule or not if you are then you have put in the right number otherwise you are not putting the right number so I think you have understood this the skill is not that complicated uh, just you have to practice this skill bit uh, and I know you will definitely practice it and uh, inshallah it will be completed thank you so much